scientists have thought extinct species of dog which is thought to have been frozen in Siberian permafrost ice for 12,400 years. Experts are examining whether the young animal was a pet while controversial South Korean cloning guru Won Woo set present at a remarkable autopsy of the extinct Pleistocene Canada has taken samples in a bring the extinct species back to life. The puppy was found to be well preserved, including the brain reported the Siberian Times which revealed the pictures and video from the procedure. The degree of preservation is about 70 to 80 percent. We will be able to say more precisely after it is extracted. For now we can see it on MRI scans. Of course, it has dried out somewhat, but the both prencephalon, cerebellum and pituitary gland are visible. We can say that this is the first time we have obtained the brain Pleistocene canid. It is the first intact brain predator from this era, he said. Sergei Fedorov, research fellow from Russia's Northeastern Federal University, said, This puppy is better preserved than the previous one. We hope get more new information. Cloning specialist Professor Wan Wu Suk satisfied with the degree of preservation. He took the samples of skin, muscles and ear cartilage. The South Korean is also working on bringing the extinct woolly mammoth back to life. St. Petersburg said, We took the samples of the ground which surrounded the carcass to find out the bacteria there. We hope to find ancient bacteria among them. A search underway for parasites, ticks, fleas on the prehistoric dog.